Our turnover up 7% uh, to 2.7 billion. Our operating profit up 9% to 270 million. Comparable earnings up 10% to 483 cents. Basic and headline earnings up 2% to 483 cents. And the dividends per share up 6% to 180 cents. The cash generated in our first half was 247 million. And uh, these numbers under review are in a period where we've been in recession. To show how resilient Udeco is, is that we managed to generate some nice cash in very difficult times. The general environment has been very difficult. And for those that are trading out there know that it's a very difficult place to do business right now, South Africa. Our second half is generally our stronger half, so we look forward to that. I think that one I've got right as well. Um, oh, this one I've also got right. The management team is experienced and focused. <laughs> uh, I think this is an important uh, one for us. You know, uh, our, our team has been around a long time. We've been through these tough times before. Um, we know what to do. Uh, we know where we have to, to focus. And the important thing for us, and if you, those that have followed Udeco for a long time, we actually do this very well. We manage the relationship between sales, gross margin, and expenses. And when things get tough like this, we, we're very quick to adapt. We're quick to move with the times. And that's why you've seen over all the years when, when the, the, the wheels have really fallen off in the economy, we still produce very respectable results. And also when things go exceptionally well, we just produce better results. So uh, uh, we'll continue to do that. I think that uh, going forward, uh, things are going to be tough. Uh, we've been successful through those tough times. I think Udeco's business model of these 31 diversified businesses uh, makes us very resilient. And uh, we generate cash. You know, we've got those businesses that are mature in mature markets that are not growing. They're generating the cash that's needed to make the acquisitions that's giving us the growth going forward. So we hope to continue the way we've done in the last years.